Hello everyone, it's Mary and welcome to my YouTube channel, Ancestral Beginnings. So today I wanted to uh, share with you a journal that I just finally completed. Um, it's going to be a gift for my daughter, Grace, who is graduating from college this weekend. And I just um, wanted to give her some type of keepsake. So a little backstory. This was started probably over six months ago. And it is from a online class that I started, um, taught by Michelle Liptick of Mickleney. And this class is on uh, Tiffany Goff Smith's uh, Southern Gals designs on her website. And I will put a link to the, that, uh, her website in the description box in case you want to check it out and, um, you know, maybe take it yourself. It's, I highly recommend. It's a great class. So the class was about rust dyeing, something that I had already been doing, but uh, there were some other really cool techniques in the class that I wanted to learn. Um, rusting metal items and, uh, you know, just really cool. So um, I thought I'd go ahead and share it with you. So here it is. Um, and this is the, the strap. I put a little vintage leaf pin on it. So obviously I did this um, as much for myself as I did for my daughter. Uh, for sure. So this is this is my grandparents on my dad's side. This is their wedding photo. This is my grandparents on my mom's side. This is my mom and dad back in 1956. And a lot of these pages are empty. I did it so that she could um, you know, fill it herself uh, when the time comes, if she would like. This is the front cover, and I did the covers, uh, the board with bingo boards. Um, I just thought that would be really cool, and I decided to leave part of the board exposed. This is my mom and dad's wedding picture. And this is part of her wedding dress and her wedding veil. I thought I'd put that in. So this is all the rust dyeing that I did. Did it on paper. I did it on linen and fabrics. This is my mom. This is my dad's old work um, address book. And phone number book from way way back so I use the word grandpa that's my dad in his um, army uniform more of my dad's handwriting Chicken wire. I used chicken wire to rust. I had uh, rusty chicken wire. This is um, me and my siblings when we were little. So I'm a triplet. So this is us when we were little. I'm in the middle. This is a letter that I wrote in school to my mother. 
That's me. First grade, my mom wrote first grade, Maple. That's the name of the school I went to, the grade school. So lots of empty picture or lots of empty pages so she can fill in as she would like. That's my 16. I was 16 when I had that picture taken. This is the triplets, my one remaining aunt who is still living. And that's my dad who passed in 2019. Um, this is the church that I belong to. This is a picture of me when I was in fourth or fifth grade or fifth or sixth grade. A little, a little, uh, tag I made. I had a rusted, um, metal flower thingy that I, I put in, in the, you know, when I was, uh, rust dyeing the paper. So that's really cool. Just another piece of ephemera tag, nothing on it, that I had rust dyed. More chicken wire print. Um, this was the pattern um, that my mom had. She had uh, a wedding uh, a dress made for one of our, our weddings, one of her kids' weddings. This is a basketball picture, eighth grade I was in. Both my sister and I were on the same team. This is a dental, um, a vintage dental uh, chart that I rust dyed. And of course that goes to me because I'm a dental hygienist. So just some random fabrics and lace on this page. Another family picture, 1972, in front of the Christmas tree. That's my mom. That's me holding Grace when she was a baby. And um, this is done with some alcohol inks and that was part of the class uh, this is tickets from a place uh, locally here where I live that we took our kids um, called acres of fun we took our kids there to play so I put that in there that's grace and there's the end this is an old um, canvas shot bag Again, rusted with the chicken wire. And then I attached, I attached a closure here and have plenty of room to, for it to get, you know, thicker. Yeah, so that was it. That was really fun to make. You know, I put it on the back burner for a really long time and um, then made the decision it was going to go to Grace. So, um, and then I wanted to show you, this is a tag that I'm going to attach to her gift bag. Um, this was a kit that I bought from Tammy of Creative Girl Vintage. And she has a YouTube channel and she sells crafting kits um, on her in her Etsy shop. So I went ahead and um, bought one of those and it just so happened. This says simply blessed and also in there was a piece of paper um, that had, you know, different sayings. And it also had Grace. And that's my daughter's name. So I had to get it. So really, really sweet. That's going to go on her bag. All right. Well, thanks so much, guys, for looking. Um, I'm wanting to do more journals. Let me know if you like uh, journals. And, you know, I'm thinking about possibly uh, making some and selling them. 
We will see. Let me know if you think that's a good idea, if you like what I did. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.